Good morning, everybody. Today is actually Tuesday, and welcome back to another week of lunches. Yesterday, the kids had um, meatball subs at school with, I think they said, peaches and carrots. So I'm also going to start doing something different, so I'll get to this in just a second. But today, the kids are actually having mac and cheese in their thermos, and it was one of those great value brand of shells and cheese that come in the little cups that you heat up in the microwave. Um, but I did still heat up thermos with boiling hot water. They sat with the lid closed for almost 15 minutes total. Um, once they were sitting for 10 minutes, then I started to heat up the mac and cheese in the microwave. I dumped out the water. I did not wipe it out because I still want the moisture in there so the mac and cheese doesn't get like clumpy or anything. So I just dumped it out, put the mac and cheese in, and then shut the lid right away. And that should stay hot until lunchtime. It's only four hours between when I pack it and when they eat lunch anyway, so it's not sitting for a super long time. So they each have mac and cheese in there. We're going to try these flavored waters this time. I got these just from Walmart. It's a Tropical Tide flavor, and I've tried a few. They're actually pretty good, so hopefully the kids will like it. And then in their systemic containers today, they both have the same thing. They have some carrots with some ranch in this container. And then they also each have a hard-boiled egg. And with Connor's, I just cut his in half and removed the yolk for him. Um, but that way they have their protein over here since there's not really any with the mac and cheese. And then they have a spoon to go with their mac and cheese, but also their fruit cup. Lacey has mandarin oranges, and then Connor has, like, the fruit cocktail with... Um, you know, the peaches and all Cheers. that stuff in it. And then for their little dessert is going to be just a package of fruit snacks. Now, this is actually Bo's. I'm going to start packing his lunch. Uh, actually, I did this this morning. I might do it the night before or in the morning with theirs. Because he's home with me full time now, but I'm trying to work from like 9 to 2. So um, I'm going to have him eat lunch a little bit earlier as well, but that way I can just grab it out of the fridge, he can sit down at the table, and he can eat it whenever he's ready. So this is just a hamburger bun that we just had some extras of. It just has peanut butter and strawberry jelly. This banana was pretty small, so this is actually like three quarters of a banana. And I did try the fruit stuff, uh, fruit fresh, that I showed you guys like two weeks ago. It says just to sprinkle it on there. I didn't do it with the water because I didn't want the banana to get like soggy. So we'll see if this helps. This is just going to go into the fridge until he's ready to eat. So we'll see if it doesn't turn brown in there. Then I just put one cheese stick and just cut it up. And then he has a few little carrot chips with some ranch as well. So that'll just sit there until he's ready. Um, and then for those guys, I will show everything all together when the kids are home from school. That way, it's just easier to keep it all together. So, we will see you guys later. Alrighty, so the kids are home. So, let me show you Bo's first, though. He ate everything. There's a tiny bit of ranch dressing in here. And this didn't even really get dirty, so I'm just going to kind of wipe it out and then set it aside. And I'll probably just use this container every day to put his lunch in. Um, but it worked out really well. And I'm going to insert a picture here. The banana did not turn brown. I think I mentioned it this morning, um, but it was in the fridge for four hours. Um, however, where is it at? There is like one gram of sugar in here. Um, and I didn't measure. I just sprinkled some onto the banana. But it totally worked. So that's super exciting. I'm also going to try it on like apples as well and see if that works too. But I thought I would share that with you guys. So, this feels like there's a little bit of ranch in here, but that's okay. The kids said that their mac and cheese was hot, which was good. I know the first time I did a thermos lunch this year, they said it wasn't very hot, but at least today's was, so that's always a good thing. What was the other thing I sent you? Oh, the fruit snacks and juice. Oh, and your, your fruit cup, right? Mm -hmm. You ate everything? Good job. What do you need? Or are you just watching? I'm just watching. Okay. All right. And then, oh, Connor's stuff is in here. But, yeah, everything is gone. His ranch is a lot more empty than Lacey's was. 
His mac and cheese is gone. And I'm assuming the bottom is empty, but we'll check just in case. Connor, did you drink your juice and eat your fruit? Awesome. So cool. Yeah, everybody ate everything. I mean, like they always do. So, yeah. <laughs> we'll see you guys tomorrow. Everybody, today is Wednesday. And these two pretty much have the same thing. This one is going to be bows. So let me go over it real quick. Connor has a peanut butter and honey sandwich in the shape of a little doggy in a doghouse. Two pieces of candy, a string cheese, half of a banana, and then there are, what is that called? Cucumbers with ranch dressing, and then a strawberry gogurt over here. And with the bananas today, what I did was I just kind of cut off, you know, like the tops and the bottoms. And then I just kind of dipped the end pieces, like, into that fruit fresh. I put some in a bowl and then dipped it on the side, so hopefully they stay fresh. And then Lacey has the same thing, except hers are on the last of the hamburger buns I had. And she has strawberry jelly with peanut butter. And then a cheese stick and a gogurt. And these are two sandwiches. I just had to cut them to make it actually fit in here. And by the way... After I was done filming yesterday, she told me I didn't pack her enough food and she was still hungry. So, hopefully an extra sandwich will be good. I might still put something else in there. I don't know. And then for Bo, I just made him a little Lunchable. That is turkey, some cheese, and crackers. He has just two cucumbers down here with some ranch already in there. And then for his banana, I did the same thing. I cut off the ends and then just kind of dipped those pieces into the fruit fresh stuff. And then the big kids are getting napkins and notes. And then they're having another one of these flavored water Capri Sun things. So we will see you guys later. All right. Everybody is done with their lunch. Um, this has been sitting a little bit longer than normal. That's why this looks so brown. Um, but, yeah, he ate everything. Lacey did, however, come home with one of the little pieces of her sandwich she did not eat her banana, and then she did have one piece of candy left, but I think she ate that. Um, she informed me she doesn't like when bananas are squishy, so basically she doesn't like ripe bananas. She wants them when they're still, like, partially green, I guess. Um, so I probably won't pack her bananas anymore. Um, but she actually threw that away, and then I think he ate everything. Maybe. Oh. Connor, you didn't eat your yogurt, buddy. Do you want your yogurt? My husband just came home, if you can hear him talking in the background. Um, ooh. See, this is why I don't send bananas, because it just it looks really gross. Um, well, he had everything but his yogurt, so I'll see if he wants that. If not, maybe I'll pack it tomorrow or whatever. But, yeah, we will see you guys back tomorrow. Good morning, everybody. Today is Thursday, and I think everybody, well... These kids have the same thing. So I kind of did, like, breakfast for lunch because they wanted a bagel. So back there is just a regular bagel with original cream cheese. Connor just has a half a one. Lacey has a whole one. They both have a uh, granola bar as well. They have some apple slices with peanut butter to dip in. Then they have a few crackers and a Baby Bell cheese. I didn't really feel like unwrapping it today, so... They can do that. <laughs> um, in the reusable good to grow bottles, I actually put milk in here to go along with our breakfast theme. Um, and those don't leak on me. I've had these for a while and I just wash them out and reuse them all the time. So I like those a lot. And then I'm reusing their little parfait containers I got at Walmart. So Lacey has frozen strawberries down there and vanilla yogurt. In the top is some granola, almond flakes, and chia seeds. And then Connor has um, mixed berries. So there's like raspberries, blackberries, blueberries, and strawberries. And then the same yogurt and chia seed um, granola thing on the top there. Um, yeah, they're getting a napkin. And then this thing has their little spoon. And then for my two-year-old, he has a few pretzel rods over here. That's a ham and cheese sandwich, and I just use one piece of bread and then fold it in half, and then I just put the dinosaur in there so it wouldn't come apart because it was folded. And then he's got a fruit cup and then some carrot chips with ranch. So I will show you guys what they have eaten when they are all done all right. later on. Everybody is done with their lunch and stuff. Um, some of Bo's um, what is that? fruit had fallen on the floor, and there's a little piece of fruit in his ranch too, so I didn't have him eat it. But he ate everything else. 
and something leaked in Lacey's lunch bag. It was all wet in, like, one corner, um, but everything seems mostly dry, so I don't know, and she ate all that and drank her milk, so I don't know if it had leaked, like, before or after lunch, and then she told me in the car that she didn't even see her peanut butter until, like, after she had eaten her apples, so I'm just going to put that back in the pantry, but she ate everything else, yeah, and Connor told me he was using his, um, or dipping his crackers in his peanut butter, so that was interesting. I don't see the pick, though. Uh-oh, we might have lost our spaceship. I'll have to ask him. They're over there watching TV. Oh, there we go. So yeah, I mean, they ate everything, though, so that's good. It's just kind of wet and sticky, so I don't know what happened today, but we will see you guys back tomorrow. Today is Friday, and Lacey actually chose to have hot lunch at school, so I just had to pack for Connor, and then I did bows again just to make it easier on myself, and the boys pretty much have the same exact thing, um, just because I was I already had everything out and it was easier, so uh, this is ham over here. Bo has ham as well back there on his little pick. This is Colby and Monterey Jack cheese. And I wanted to cut Connors into a cute shape, but then I remembered that these are like rectangles. So instead of using one of my smaller ones or like a circle, it's kind of rectangular. So they're just X's <laughs> from my Valentine's thing that had X's and O's. What? Bug. Where? It's what bug? <sighs> There's a dead little beetle in the hallway and we were freaking out about it. Anyway, um... I think I said those were from my Valentine's thing. I had X's and O's, so that's what that is. And Bo has, like, the remnants, basically, from me cutting out the shapes, so I don't waste anything. He's not going to care. He's still going to eat it. Then they both have some of the multigrain crackers. Bo has two little um, Skittles, I think, or jelly beans. I don't remember. They're from Easter. We still have not gotten through our Easter candy. <laughs> then they both have some carrot chips with ranch. And then this is just an apple split up with the lemon juice and water mixture. Um, this is some honey roasted peanuts and pistachios. <clears throat> Excuse me. I didn't like that there was a space here. So I filled it with some nuts. And then Connor has a few Skittles or jelly beans or whatever down here. Then he's got a grape Kool-Aid burst or blast whatever it's called um grape and then he's got a napkin and a note so we will check in with you guys later Alrighty, everyone's done with lunch and home so Bo ate everything he just kind of stacked everything up for me um so that was helpful and then connor i think ate everything he said we will see yep and I did have, this is a different pick than yesterday, but it was actually just in his lunch bag. So I did not lose the spaceship yesterday either. And he ate everything else. So he did good. Let me know in the comments if you guys, or by a thumbs up, if you guys are okay with seeing the toddler lunches with the kids lunches. It's a little bit easier for me just to film together since I make them all at the same time. Uh, let me know if you want to see these ones separate or if you're good with it together. I hope you guys enjoyed the video this week. Make sure to subscribe. Give it a thumbs up. You can also follow me on Instagram and Facebook. The links are down below in the description box. I hope you guys are having a great weekend and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.